So Jordan Schultz, NFL um, national reporter, uh, tells us this. Western Kentucky wide receiver Malachi Corley, top 30 visits with the Steelers yesterday, followed by the Browns, uh, Cowboys, Ravens, the rest of the week. So that's intriguing. Uh, Corley is a guy, when you look at the, the types of receivers that they have, he would be a guy they don't necessarily have a guy like that. You know, a bigger bodied guy that is yard after the catch and and those kind of things. Yeah, he's interesting. I mean, I think that type of play is what allowed him to carry the load at Western Kentucky the way he did carry the load in their passing game. And I know I've seen him pop up on mock drafts. I definitely think that's somebody who's going to be available. But again, I've seen this other trend, too, now, which is more and more people getting away from this idea of them needing to take a wide receiver in the second round. I mean, I've always kind of been off that train after my last two drafts. You just kind of realize Andrew Barry has really only drafted for need once with his first pick. And it was when they got Jed Wills in 2020, and we haven't really seen him do that again. So I don't think that they're necessarily going to be tied into taking a receiver or like taking a interior D lineman just because we think, oh, those spots are somewhat weaker. I, I don't think that's how they operate. I think it really depends from player to player how they have their board laid out, if there's a guy who they think has a ton of value. But, yeah, I mean, Corley does have something they don't have, but I always just kind of steer the conversation <laughs> almost away from, oh, the, because they don't have this, that's what they're going to be chasing because I just don't think we've seen Andrew Barry – uh, operate like that. And I do think that gets overlooked when analysts talk about this team and their needs and that sort of thing. Yeah, and it's worked with Martin Emerson and Dewan Jones. Those were two areas you, you wouldn't have thought they needed a tackle. You wouldn't have thought they needed a cornerback. And those are two guys, uh, third and fourth rounders, that have done pretty well.